Well, I bet you didn't think we'd be broadcasting from Greece today, but then again, you probably didn't think that the debacle in Greece would be affecting mortgage rates. That's right, we're in front of the Acropolis, Greece's most famous landmark which displays the longevity of Greek civilization. But for the time being, Greeks' big debt woes that are pretty much all over the news right now, and the fact they pulled out nearly a billion euros mm -hmm. on just Monday, actually is changing mortgage interest rates. Yeah. Interesting. Do you know all the different factors that go into interest rates? You're about to find out. Welcome back to Mortgage Resource TV. As mortgage rates hovered near record lows, potentially break through that barrier of the 3.875 mark, you may want to know why. Yeah, it's not the Fed that actually controls mortgage rates, although I think that's what a lot of people think. It's actually called mortgage-backed securities, which are bond prices that rise and fall based on economic data. Yeah, and in fact, the economic data that actually changes bond prices and therefore interest rates includes hundreds of factors, everything from housing starts to the stock market. Yeah, and actually, if you're in the market for a home loan, you should be rooting for the stock market to go down. In fact, you should be rooting for bad economic news all around. Yeah. And inflation is the arch enemy of mortgage rates, so inflationary figures are a good thing to keep an eye on, whether you're in real estate or out looking to buy a home. Ryan, it really is enough to kind of make your head spin, especially if you don't even know the factors to look out for. So a good rule of thumb is to make sure that your lender has their eye on mortgage-backed security prices or else it could cost you or your clients thousands of dollars over the life of the loan. Yeah, and, and no one wants to spend more money than they need to on their mortgage or how will they have enough to take their next vacation to the beach? All right, keep your shirt on for a second, Ben. And make sure that while you're not at the beach, you're watching mortgage-backed securities to save people money on their mortgages. Oh, and of course, if you're out looking for a mortgage, root for bad economic news if you want lower rates. I mean, that's how we got rates this low in the first place, a lot of bad economic news. And that's it. That's just a quick note on how Greece and other economic news affects mortgage rates. So catch you next time on Mortgage Resource TV.